Now the next thing is we are going to draw a line. So basically to draw a line, we can create different types of line. So there are anti-allies line. So anti-allies allies line means smooth lines. And allies lines means the jagged lines or stair step lines. So if you want to create a normal line, then we will go for pygame.draw.line. So line pygame dot draw dot line and here first thing is I need to pass the surface then I need to set the color which is blue then I need to pass the starting point and the end point of the line so starting point is yeah 0 comma 0 is the first point and uh, the next point is for example 20 comma 30 Okay, and width parameter which is optional. In the case of circle, this is the center point and this is the radius. So I'm going to change the radius. Okay, this is the center point and this is the radius. So this is the this is the line parameters which we have set. So it will draw a line for us. The next type of line is uh, if you want to draw a multiple contiguous lines, then you can do that with the help of pygame dot draw dot lines. So, with the help of this, you can draw the multiple lines, but which are contiguous, okay? So, let's copy paste this and uh, uh, we will do some changes in the code itself. So, write here lines and pygame.draw.lines, okay? So, display dot comma, now just change the color here. I'm going to draw this white line and if you are going to pass more coordinates and you have to pass it in the double double uh, square brackets so this is the first point this is the second point and let's write one more point here okay now after drawing the multiple lines we are going to uh, draw now anti allies lines anti allies lines means the smooth lines so if you want to draw the smooth lines then we can do that with the help of the aa lines function so, anti-aliasing is generally used in fast game so that curved edges, shadows, filters look smooth and realistic. And uh, also, we can avoid the stair step lines or jagged objects or edges. Okay. So, AA lines, anti-aliasing lines. So, the syntax is pygame dot draw dot AA lines. And here, the first thing is surface. The another thing is the color. The next thing is we need to pass the coordinates of the line. So let's draw a straight line. And set the Boolean value. Okay. So, these are the different parameters which we have set to draw a line and this is not capital, it should be in small letters. Okay. Now, finally, let's draw the last primitive which is arc. So, again, we can use pygame.draw.arc. And here we are going to pass the parameter. The first thing is we are going to set the screen. Then we are going to set the color. So I'm going to use yellow color. Then you have to pass the rectangle coordinates like X and Y coordinates here. So let's pass any coordinates. And then finally, we are going to pass the angle like start angle and end angle for the rectangle. So this is the start angle and this is the end angle for the rectangle and again the width parameter which is optional. Now finally we must need to update the background in the while loop if you want to check the output. So update the screen with what we have drawn. So this must happen after all the drawing commands are done. So this screen will update according to the clock ticks. So the clock tick is 20. After 20 frame per second, the screen will update. So there are two parameters to update the screen. First is the update and another one is the 
flip method so we can you can use any one of these so if you want to update the entire screen go for flip if you want to update just some areas of the screen then go for update so it is actually present in the display class and then finally we are going to quit the game so pygame dot quit method not only quit just quits the deallocates the resources which are acquired by the pygame and it also uninitializes the models which are initialized before and at the end you can also write the quit command to exit or to shut close down the program okay you can also remove this so this is the program which we have created for pygame now let's run this code and see what happens we got first error which is unexpected intent let's run this we got another error which is set mode so underscore should be there let's run this name screen is not defined i have used screen somewhere screen dot field yeah it should be display dot field not screen so close this because it's so in this case you can restart and clear output and again run the program okay so we got the output here it's not responding so let's restart it and check the output black is not defined we are getting this error because we have not defined the color so first we need to define the color codes as well so let's define the color so the color code for the black is 0 0.0 the next is for white the color code is 255,255,255 this is the rgb format we are creating a tuples then let's set the value for blue which is 0,0,255,255 then red is equal to 255 comma 0 comma 0 okay so now let's try to run this one more time first we will restart it we will clear the output and then we will run it one more time let's run it we got the output we need to restart kernel green is not defined okay so we need to define the green color as well let's restart and clear output see this is the output which we got we got ellipse circle this is the solid circle rectangle solid rectangle line this is the smooth line so this is the aa lines which we have drawn anti aliasing lines and this is the normal lines okay so in this way you can create different uh, color codes and for the graphics and you can create the drawing primitives okay so as i clicked the cross button the this this function gets invoked which is pygame.quit and the 
program terminates and the modules are uninitialized 